I was really looking forward to this investigation and now it's actually fucking terrifying. Hello everyone. In the Whaley House. Felton's fucking possessed is like not the best thing to do. <laughs> Like, bro, it was so real. Dude! We have waited six years to <laughs> yeah. finally come back to the Whaley house. Not only just to come back, but to stay there overnight mm -hmm. and have a full-blown paranormal investigation. Yeah. And of course, I brought something really cool. Mm -hmm. It was it was fun. Yeah. Everyone enjoyed yeah. it. We had a good time. I cried. It was it was super. Matt it was cried. super cool. Yeah. You guys almost all quit. Like yeah. You know, it was like a fun night where everyone was like super terrified. I was like, this is great because of what you brought. If you don't know. We're going on tour, August and September, 20 different locations around the US, but we just added the Whaley House. Half the tickets are already sold out and no one even knows about it yet. That's insane. So insane. many more locations, Waverly Hills, Pythian Castle, mm -hmm. Missouri State Pen, USS oh. Salem, USS Hornet, Eloise Asylum, we're going to Old Joliet Pen, we're going to Penhurst, yeah. Fairfield Infirmary. Yeah. It's so, just overnightparanormal.com. Yeah guys, seriously, come out, let's take some pictures and let's go ghost hunting. Every single person that comes out, we're gonna meet you, we're gonna say hi, we're gonna take pictures. Oh yeah. Meet and greets, Q and A's live show. Uh, the live show is being filmed to become a YouTube series. I'm honestly so excited to meet all of you, investigate with all of you, just check it out, learn more, hope to see you there. Yeah! And uh, enjoy enjoy this video because I did. Yeah, Oh, I, of course you did because we all freaking cried. I enjoyed this video so hey, much. Hey, comment down below also what you think Elton did to make us cry. What do you mean what I did? It was you. Uh, was it me? Or was it what's inside of me? Yeah. Mm. Yeah, 50 50. Was it me? You know what I mean? Or was it like me? Ha! You know what I mean? Was it was it, like you. It was like, okay. Yeah. All right. You know, it, was like, it, was like, it was like a demon if it had a voice crack. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It was like you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's cool. Yeah. Okay, cool. This is, this is a fun video. This is a really fun video. Elton likes to torture us! <laughs> What's up everyone and welcome Ooh. to or welcome back to the Overnight Channel where we are dedicated to everything paranormal, unknown, unsolved, mysterious, can't explain it, don't know why it happened, don't know why we did it, don't know what's gonna happen, don't know what we're doing, don't know why we're clapping, but we're fucking here and it's a damn Whaley house and if you don't know why I'm excited. Six years I have been trying to film Six, six years. years. That's a it's six it's like time. five years and ten months. By the time this video comes out, it'll be six years. Yeah. Wow. We came here in 2016 yep. before we knew anything about ghost hunting, yep. anything about paranormal, and we got denied. Yeah. We booked tickets. We told them we were filming, and yeah. they didn't get a film permit. Yeah. And no one has filmed here since 2014. That's ghost Adventure. Classic. We're the first ones to film here. For Let's go. The infamous. The, the most haunted house in America. Come on! Dubbed twice by Times Magazine. Yep. We have it for the entire night. Let's go. To ourselves. <laughs> the whole night? The whole yeah, night. The whole entire night. night. <laughs> okay. yeah. I'll be honest. I'm kind of happy the way things happened because had we investigated here when we did, we wouldn't have known anything. No. True. Now no. what we have, all the tools, mm -hmm. a full moon. Yeah, yeah, full yeah there's a full moon, full moon somewhere. somewhere. Yeah. It's, it's Behind the clouds. It's, it's, there was a, it's I don't hiding. even think we didn't even have tools back then. No, we had a Ouija board. A Ouija board. A Ouija board and That's that was still it. good, but now we have everything. But now yeah. we have our own Ouija everything. boards. Yep. We have double boards. Wow. We have all these paranormal devices. I yeah. might have brought a surprise that was really hard to get to and it might be worth a million dollars and maybe I paid a lot of money to rent it here and it's here for one night. Wait, what? But maybe we have a lot of these different things. I'm not really sure, but we definitely we We're definitely have our own Ouija wait, wait, boards. Link in bio if you guys want to grab one. We do. So we do. that's definitely wow. happened tonight. But what'd yeah. you say before that? Yeah, there was a thing that you sped past. Oh, we dollar have like a K2, we have like dowsing rods. Oh, yeah. We have uh, no, no, the place, after that. We have a place to ourselves. Yes, after after that, that, yeah, we have cat dollars. balls, maybe something worth a million dollars we have entirely to ourselves tonight I, that was really hard to get to. That's hard. That's hard. Yeah, but it's yeah, but I'm just saying, like, we have so many devices we can use, and maybe we have something wrapped under the girly, and you can't touch it. If you do, you might die. But that's fine. So, well, what's the thing? I don't want to touch it. It's fine. You won't have to until you do. You think after six years, 
of trying to get this place and I finally get it. You don't think I'm gonna have like a surprise for us? You know, well, you I always, have to. Yeah, you always I, have one. I love you guys though. Yo, okay. Yep, Thank do you? you? All of Everything we could need and more. Yep. yep. And more in there. Yeah. And we have a tour guide that we'll be meeting up with. He knows the history and all the paranormal stories. He's okay. been here for nearly a decade. Wow. Y'all ready to yeah. go in? Yeah. <laughs> Y'all ready for this? That's what we're going to do. Ghost, 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 ghost. Well, let's ghost inside. He said a pun. He said, let's ghost inside. Yes. You get it? Like a ghost. Because there's ghosts inside. This is as far as we made it six years ago, right here on the steps. You guys didn't even knock on the door. Literally, they were like, you don't have a film permit. That was it. That was it. We didn't know better back then. But right here, this is where our camera was not Yeah. Oh yeah, that's right. right. Once praised as the finest home in Southern California, the historic Whaley House now resides in Old Town, San Diego. A seemingly ordinary but exceptional home became known for bouts of tragedy and misfortune. Although many say that the property was doomed for an ill fate long before construction of the home began. More than 150 years after being built, the Whaley House has been granted and holds on to the title of the most haunted house in America. Long before the floor or walls of the home had began construction, this piece of land served as the public gallows, a place for those convicted of crimes were to await justice, death, by hanging. The precise number of lives taken on this small plot of land, all while witnesses consumed their fate as entertainment, is unknown. In 1852, an unfortunate story was born as a man died. His name was Yankee Jim Robinson, a horse thief convicted of grand larceny when stealing a rowboat with the plans to utilize it as a method to steal a much larger and faster boat. He was found guilty and sentenced to hang right where the Whaley family's couch now resides. Unlike all of those whom had died in this very place before him, Yankee Jim's death was not as painless. He was a foot taller than all of the others that had placed their head within the noose before him. And when he was hung, the rope had been measured for a shorter man. Instead of dying from a broken neck, his feet were able to barely graze the ground, resulting in a slow, agonizing death of strangulation. Endless moments, gasping for air, kicking at the ground to stay alive, until the fight was ultimately lost. Although he has left this world physically, his spirit is known to haunt the Whaley House for the last 170 years. He is most known for his heavy footsteps coming from the upstairs of the home, causing tightness of the lungs of visitors and even marks around their necks. It is said that Thomas Whaley himself was a witness to his execution and shortly after purchased the property, where he would then begin construction of his new home, where the gallows once stood, place of death, now became a living room. The grim past of this property is believed to be the reason this home and those who have lived in it and even to this day, those that enter it have been cursed. And all of the tragedy that was bestowed upon the Whaley family seems to have only proven the curse was unfortunately far too real. Thomas Whaley came to the West during the gold rush in 1849 while first arriving in San Francisco until later making his way to San Diego. He was largely a merchant by profession, which later influenced additions to the house and on May 6th, 1856, began construction with the intention of it becoming Becoming the finest home in all of San Diego. Two stories furnished with mahogany and rosewood, amongst other expensive commodities. Thomas, his wife Anna, and their six children would then move there in 1857, where it would become a central gathering place for the San Diego community. Even when all the guests would leave and all of the family was laid to rest, reports of footsteps were heard nearly every night. Thought to be Yankee Jim, seeking vengeance and for others to join him in the spirit world. The Whaley's first encounter with the spare was when their 18-month son, Thomas, passed away from scarlet fever. And just a mere few months later, a fire started in the home, destroying the general store. This was just the beginning. It is believed that Thomas, Anna, and four of their children all passed away within the home and still remain there today. The tragic death of the other family members and guests of the Whaley House will be detailed as we go throughout the home, with each of them having their own grim story. 
The widest variety of paranormal activity has been documented here. Inexplicable mist, lights turning on and off, light fixtures swinging without explanation, rocking chairs moving on their own, footsteps, giggling, crying, laughing, grunting, screaming, and as we have experienced in our past visit, electrical malfunctions. Nearly 100,000 visitors per year come to the Whaley House to experience the rich history and terrifying ghost stories within it. Nearly six years after our first attempted visit, we are finally here today to connect with the past. We know the Whaley House. Hey, three, you hit three knocks. Introduce yourself. From the three knocks? Go. Three knocks? Yep, yep, yep. Yeah. Finish it. Finish it. Okay. Yep, 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 well, I'm walking people out. <laughs> from oh, coming in. Do you guys remember how he was possessed? Yeah. Not how convenient. It's not proven. And it's not disproven. Now he's locking us up. The witches flew in from Canada and tried to possess me. It's yeah. a lot of work for a Tuesday. It yeah. is. It's a great start to this magical moment. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Welcome to the Whaley House, guys. Thank you. Yeah. So let's go into the first room. You guys want to come over here? Oh, wow. This Whoa. is really cool. Dude. Okay. The actual location of the hanging was right here underneath this archway. Wow. Whoa. This is the first time you're actually able to access this as members of the public. Throughout the years, people have claimed that as you walk through the house, they'll feel pressure on their chest or on their neck. And they believe that was attributed to the ghost of Yankee Jim Robinson. And in some occasions, and it's happened fairly often, people have a red line that goes around your neck, no. stays there for a few minutes, and then disappears. No. Wow. So they attribute that to the Yankee Jim Robinson as well. I think I just heard something in there already. I mean, I'm getting a little freaked out. Violet Whaley, her story, one of heartbreak, is incredibly grim. In 1885, Violet married a man named George, a con man, who ran away shortly after their marriage as he declared he only wanted her dowry, the property and money brought by a bride to their husband upon their marriage. Violet was filled with so much shame that she ended up taking her father's gun to the outhouse, where she shot herself in the chest. She was, in fact, alive when they found her. She was brought to the downstairs guest bedroom, where she died. Only 22 years of age, and upon her death, she was found to have left a cryptic note. It read, mad from life's history, swift to death's mystery, glad to be hurled anywhere, anywhere out of this world. An excerpt from a poem by Thomas Hood. This downstairs guest bedroom that shares a wall with the gallows of Yankee Jim is where Violet is still seen, as well as near the second floor windows, where she spent most of her time alone after the divorce, full of sorrow. The pump organ is believed to be Anna Whaley's pump organ. No way. Wow. That's awesome. Does it still play? Yeah, it still sounds pretty good. You guys want to hear it? Yeah, yeah can, you play? can you play? Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 hear not only music playing, uh, but singing, you know, people performing. And we'll talk about the theater when we go back wow. upstairs. The gun that she used to kill herself, we believe, fell into the outhouse after she used it. Oh, okay. And no, it wasn't ever recovered. You know what, we had an archeological dig done here between 2008 and 2012. What, that? you? Did he touch that, I don't know. No, I did not touch <laughs> that. No, 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 he didn't. Was no, that. I was no, watching that. that. That's, that scared me. He did not touch he it. He did not dude, touch it. Dude, that's no, it was above my head. I'm yeah, not yeah. tall enough. I'm short. <laughs> that was not me. The one time I'll, I'll say I'm short. The camera was on, right? I got on camera. Yeah, dude, right that's there. that's Wait. terrifying. I literally. Is that it just fell off? Does yeah. it fall down quite a bit? Actually, I don't think it ever has. And wow. I mean, what? There's dude, obviously that, 
I really went. I went thriller. I went. <laughs> you can just leave it there. Yeah, at this no, point. What? We don't want it to follow you home. Okay. <laughs> What? Dude! Alright! Alright, everybody, let's not get so close together! Let's yeah, all spread out! Let's spread out a little bit! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we should all stay together and hold hands. That's a good idea. No, it's okay. Oh, okay. he's possessed. Don't fuck out. <laughs> That's why I have to. Yeah. I imagine it wasn't just the one hanging at the gallows. I'm sure those were the town gallows. Yeah, there's a few documented ones, and actually, some of these uh, folks are buried down the street at the Campo Santo Cemetery. So oh, you guys have wow. a moment at some point, you might want to go and check those out. Yankee Jim is down there. He is the one that most people claim they see when they are in the museum. Is there, is there anyone else in the house right now? Not at the moment. I Nobody would say, had a giant no, no, yeah, like, are you hearing that? And also, I, I believe all the rooms upstairs are barricaded off, right? So yeah, there's nobody could, in the room. So what? You keep, what are you talking about? It's like a jingling. Like, I, I there, keep hearing noise. You can't do that behind I my back. No, I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't have let a ghost be behind you. <laughs> well, you wouldn't really do it. Stop it. <laughs> I mean, you obviously didn't stop it. So. I, I, I was lying. Now you're lying. Now lying. I was you're lying. You're lying. You literally lied out there. Oh, your light just died, didn't you? What? Your light just died. Yeah. I just watched your light die. Those lights don't do that. What? Huh? It was not like it. No, it's a hundred percent charged battery. We nope. That's a perfectly good battery. Oh, the lights literally not even turning on. Yeah. Awesome. Good start. Uh, okay. Okay. Wait, what? Yeah, wait. This is a huge battery. Like. No, I know. This thing is, should not be dying. Like this huge ass battery. Did we hear that? This should not be dying. Like this huge ass battery. Well, the room above you is closed off right now, so I don't know. Okay, maybe yeah. the that was like that was like a table being pushed. Yeah, it was like. Ooh. Yeah, that was weird. What are we doing about the light? We get a new battery and try it. Let's try a new battery. Yeah. I'm with you. The fuck? Fully charged. I charged everything. It shouldn't die. Either sure. way, he was standing right here. He also said that's never happened before. And it's like, if that kind of thing falls, like that falls quite often. They would know. Yes, yeah. And they do tours here all the time. Every day. That was literally right up here. Yeah. It was it was like a it's like this chest being moved. And then light dies immediately. Yeah. Well, I think we're gonna have a fun time tonight. Yeah. Don't fall on your lead now. I think so. I don't know, <laughs> I don't know if we can beat that, but yeah, absolutely. Uh, well, let's all right. <laughs> Some point. Oh, oh really? What? Oh, I definitely yeah. didn't think we what? would be able to. That's awesome. That is where Thomas Whaley Jr. passed away of oh. scarlet fever. A couple of dolls back in the day in that room, and I was doing some cleaning, and one doll actually began to open and close her eyes, or at least move or flicker her eyes. Whoa! Whoa! This is cool. As a center point of the community, the Whaley House eventually expanded to include not only a courthouse, but a theater as well. One of the performers, Thomas Tanner, is known to have passed away just after two weeks performing on the stage. He is said to have died somewhere in the upstairs area of the home. The theater was later turned into a parlor and became the final resting place of Anna Whaley. This is now a room where her presence is often felt, as she is said to adore the entertainment and makes herself known with the smell of lavender perfume. If I were to do my next special here, is that an actual possibility to rent this place out for a performance? I will produce it. Are you yeah. serious? Yeah. Can we do that here? Yeah. That would be incredible. Yeah, yeah, the camera, perfect. it's happening. Why yeah. not? What? There you go. Why not? Shake there you go. No! Yeah! I did it! No! I did that it! Yeah! He shook my hair! You trying to wipe it off on me? <laughs> trying to wipe it off on my back? Get out of here! Get out! No! Yeah! No! You did it! I'm bathed in the blood of Jesus Christ. <laughs> Oh God! Oh, wow. that was wow. dirty. <laughs> Good job. That was dirty. You're like the Hollywood baby you made a deal with the devil. Oh my God! And, and it was a deal too. You actually made a deal. <laughs> Sometimes we walk through the museum. We have guests that are experiencing different. How can I say? Elements of the haunted stories of the Whaley House, including encountering the ghost of the family pets. The Whaley's were known to have several pets, including one dog named Dolly. As you walk through the house, you mount with something licking your leg or brushing up against your leg. 
and they believe it's the ghost of these dogs. Sometimes, after the guests experience this, they run out of the house in pure terror, only to find out there's other pets outside that they'll also encounter. <laughs> saw something on the ground. Uh, looked like a wafer, if you will. And like a kid, you know, picks it up, puts it in the mouth, eats it, and immediately starts to not feel well. Very quickly, she passed away at the age of three. What she ate was a wafer that was laced with this. What? This is Kellogg's Ampaste. Oh, jeez. Oh, yeah. Wow, this is the general store in Corbin, the focal point of the Whaley family name within the community, the main aspiration of Thomas Whaley. Passing away of natural causes in 1890, he is still seen throughout the house as a full-bodied apparition. Described as wearing a frock, coat, and top hat, he is most commonly seen waiting, staring directly at you or intensely working. Reports of cigar smoke and furniture moving are commonly attributed to Thomas. There have been no new residents in the Whaley House since 1953, yet renovations have continued to maintain the historic integrity of the home. All of those whom have worked here in the evening hours have encounters with the paranormal, unknown children's spirits in the first floor of the home, as well as encounters with Dolly, the Whaley family dog. Uh, a lot of EVPs have taken here, place here, including um, one of the first seance sessions that happened here in the early 1960s. This is going to be awesome. I'm so excited to investigate tonight. Did they have like a, a bird cage? Uh, this is uh, something that was added on in the last hour and a half. So. Wait, hey, is that wait, a surprise wait, wait, thing? Wait, wait, what is it? Find out like after we investigate. After? Well, like maybe halfway through investigating. Okay, wonderful. Oh. Is there, what was that? What was like, that? A horse? Uh, no, we don't move for it. I don't know. Those are the rings. Those are pretty silent outside. I was actually about to ask you for anything. anything look under it. Look under it. Hey, wouldn't no. touch it. Wouldn't touch that. Wouldn't, wouldn't touch that. Wouldn't, definitely wouldn't put your hands on that. You guys want to go start with it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Let's yeah, let's get away from that. Go start with it. Go start with it. So, what is it? Oh, that's going to be fun. Yeah. <laughs> Which way are you going? This way? We're going to go up there, yes. Okay. You, you good? Yeah. yeah. Let's do this. Yeah. Let's do it. One. One. Time to figure out who was paying attention during the tour. Oh. <laughs> and remember no. things. Okay. If you get one correct, you are safe. The loser goes in the house by themselves. For the duration of the time it takes the rest of us to walk to the cemetery, Visit Yankee Jim. Oh, that's and come hilarious. Back. <laughs> you remember who lost to Queen Mary? What was the fruit offered to Violet? Yep, there! I know! Peach. Damn it. Nice. Let's go! Oh, oh, it. Look at God! Oh, oh we're we're nice, baby. baby! What was the poison meant to kill? It's ants. Very good. Oh, oh, damn. I'm you, but how do you Oh, boy. Here we go. Oh, boy. Here I we... knew both of those. Damn. What was the name of the theater troupe? Uh, it was the Thomas Tanner troupe. Very good. Oh, Let's go. Let's go. I love this game. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, my God. Go. By the way, how fast do you guys walk? Because I'm normally like a... Oh, I crawl most I kinda, of the time. I'm kind of at this kind of a Oh, pace. for how we're going to walk? I hurt yeah, my to knee. the cemetery. Because you've got to stay in there as yeah. long as it takes us to walk to the cemetery and uh -huh. back. I hurt my knee going pro oh, a couple yeah. years ago. You want to, so. on the way, on the walk there, do you want to stop at the doctor? I would love yeah. to. Go get a yeah. check. <laughs> I also separated, yeah, I separated my shoulder, so I have to stop Okay, yeah, yeah, that's a good time point. To time okay. too. All right, well, let's let's maybe start the investigation. Let's like stir up some activity, and then we should... And then we should leave him. Yeah. Cool. Like make sure idea. he's got company in the house before we leave. Here we go. <laughs> Let's go to the house. We're going to the Whaley house. Here we go. We're about to walk inside. Investigation time. 
I think it's fair to say that didn't go the whaley you expected ah. it to. <laughs> well, well, whaley. <laughs> you turns got me you, there. Turns out that you knew the whaleyist about the house. I oh. actually knew the first two questions. I just didn't know we were raising our hand until the second question, and my hand was in my pocket because it's cold. I'm sorry, I don't want hyper. -thermia. My hands were fully hyper? in my pocket. Hyper? hyper <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm so cold! I'm so cold! Come on, guys! I'm so it's cold. so fucking cold out here! Walking inside the whaley house! Yeah. Well, 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 whaley! Man, this house sure seems haunted! Are you guys excited too? I agree, Corbin. Man, this is gonna be a good video! <laughs> Investigation time! Can we like do like a victory thing together? Yeah. Yeah. yeah what's we all jump. Oh. Nope. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> we already did it. We already did it. What's gonna be? What's Possess gonna happen? Possess me once. Possess me once. Shame on, on you. you. Possess <laughs> me twice. Uh, I'm still, still, still shame on you. Still shame on you. For time to investigate. Where did he run away? Where did, where did Corey go? Corey's gone. <laughs> Okay, so I went and did what every normal human does. I went pee pee, nice. okay? Uh -huh. Then I go out from going pee pee, uh -huh. no one's outside. So I'm like, okay, I'm, a, I'm gonna assume that they all walked inside. So I come in, I open the door, and I'm like, okay, I hear voices walk this way. As I'm standing right here, I can see the chair, and I see someone's back. Like, I just thought, like, it was just like, just like a black hoodie. What? Yes, and I'm like, oh, okay, they're in here. So then I come right here, I turn, I see some of y'all sitting right there. So I walk in, I look right here, and there's no one. Well, you know that's his actual original desk, right? Really? Yeah. This is the, one of the one things in the house is actually original. There's like three things in here that's original, and it's, that's one of them. Also, and I, I have to stay here by myself. That seat has been sat. See? What did I miss? No, actually, that's I, weird. I, I, that that's seat's weird. been sacked. I thought one of you guys were sitting, or I walked in and saw someone sitting here. It's definitely pressed down like someone was sitting there. I thought it was either Kyle or Matt sitting here. Like, I just see, like, all black, just like this, like, hunched over. And I was like, oh, they're in here. I turn in here, there's no one sitting there. That's pretty freaky. That is amazing. Well, here's a, here's a fun fact, Corey. At least now you know you won't be alone. That's true. <clears throat> You have a study nice. buddy the whole time, actually. You guys can do homework together. Yo, somebody's get, who's getting down? <laughs> I did not at all think that that was a ghost. No, you thought that somebody was just sitting there. I thought it was one of y'all. Like, bro, it was so real. And like, was he like writing? Or was no, he, like, they he look was at just hunched over. It was just back. One way to find out if it's here. I'm like freaking out, but happy at the same time. You're so, ha you look so happy. Do I? Yeah. But I'm actually scared as well, because I have to stay here by myself. But you're not I've never seen something so real. Comment down below if you guys think I'm gonna be safe tonight. <laughs> it's a dollhouse. A doll. A dollhouse. It's a doll. It's like a Barbie house, right? Like it's a replica of the Whaley house. Huh? But a dollhouse style, where you could like open it up and like play with little figures and stuff. Mm -hmm. So what it actually oh, is? Yes. It's a replica of the Whaley house, and then I had voodoo dolls made of each of us. And then when you go to the room, I'll trigger activity. It's you would actually do that, is that you it? You would actually do that. No, but now I think about it. <laughs> that's a no, good idea. No, no, <laughs> no, no, I mean, no, no, it no, sucks. No. That would suck for us. That's a good idea. No, that's a great experiment. No, it's not. No, that's actually a really good experiment. No, no, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. What are you talking about? Oh my god, that's so good. That's so good. We find a haunted house in New Orleans, we find a voodoo practitioner, no. we get a replica made of the house, voodoo dolls of each So you can go stab us? us? Bro, you go into the house to see if there's any activity, and then you don't know when anything's happening to your voodoo house, and it's... No. Oh my god, it's such a good idea! State of Louisiana! It's such a good idea! 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 I think state of Louisiana, please ban Elton and Castell from ever entering your state ever again. We'll, 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 we'll go to Haiti. We'll go to Haiti. We're originating. No, 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 no. Also, yeah. also don't let him go there either. Haiti? He hates Cancel him. him. What, do you hate Haiti? I hate you. <laughs> <laughs> we have all the gear. Yes. If you're new to the channel, if you're new to ghost hunting, if this is your first ghost video ever, pick a good one. We kind of have 
every kind of paranormal tool. We have a little bit of everything for each family member of the house. We should like maybe try and simplify things. I mean, he even said that people have done one of the first seances was right here <clears throat> at the table. Yeah. And I don't, I don't know if we've ever led ourselves through one. Normally we have a responsible adult to yeah. walk us but through. Yeah, but instead we have me and our friend. I so, oh, it's a person! I mean, as much as we joke and use tools, mm -hmm. I think all the times that we've become like genuine, like we want to speak to you and like yeah. show that kind of passion and interest. Mm -hmm. And Lily would be another example. Yeah, you know? All huge. of our best activities come from being like, hey, we're like, we actually want to talk. We all can join hands, can join our energy, and just kind of. <laughs> <laughs> Going. I mean, just said, I feel like we all know how to do this. This could join energy, you can join. You just took out all the energy on that table. I hate it here. Oh man. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> yeah, you can start. Alright, I'll start. I don't even know how we begin, but let's just try to sing. Hello, residents, guests, lingering spirits of the Whaley House. Or this courtroom. My name is Elton, and I'm, I'm joined here by my friends. And we come here with the pure intention of communicating with anyone who may still be here. Whether it is by showing yourself physically, making a sound, walking about the house, whispering directly into our ears, utilizing any of our devices but we truly and wholeheartedly wish to have any form of communication with you and if you could do us that favor tonight in one way or another i would greatly appreciate it hello everyone in the whaley house the spirits souls elementals people whatever whoever you are we ask that you will please come in this room or anywhere throughout the house. Speak with us tonight. Show us that you are here. We do not mean harm at all. We just want to talk to you, get to know you. Hello, my name is Matthew. What? Yeah, one second, one second. I gotta go to the bathroom. Really? Yeah. Should I follow? Phone two? That's really fucking weird. But I'll also be honest, I don't know if him like breaking that circle. I don't think there's any rules to like breaking the same. Spirits, we are sorry we're putting this on pause. We'll be right back. I'm pretty sure that was a big no-no. Even for me. Well, I'm technically, well, actually, my man, shower. The same <laughs> oh my man. I am like I'm I'm like genuinely like I'm pretty certain that was a really big no-no. I should go check on though. Should I should I? I mean yeah, because the weird broke the circle and the seance and it's it's kinda like starting the Ouija board and then not saying goodbye. I'm pretty sure that's what we just did. Come here, Frank, come here, guys. Okay, everybody, everybody, everybody. Let's just, yeah, you guys aren't asleep at all. Let's just, okay. <laughs> okay, we are sorry, but we will be right back and we'll get right back to this and talking to you. There's been an emergency and you probably already know what that emergency is, so thank you and we'll see you after these short messages. Like he actually had to be going through some like pain. You know what I mean? He's throwing up. Not the start we had hoped for. No. Um, I will say he's closest to the. That is true. Are you the last one? Ah! No, he was the last one. No, 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 no. Not what I'm talking about. Not what I'm talking about. You're the last one. What does that mean? It's your turn next. 
Okay. It's your turn, next. The order in which things have happened tonight. Who had a curtain fall on his head? Who? Who saw someone in the chair? Corey. Who just had something happen to his stomach? Oh no. Who hasn't had anything happen to him yet? Who's not gonna have anything happen to him? Who hasn't had anything happen to him? Oh, oh, I don't yet. like that at all. I don't like that at all. Oh, oh look behind you. Dude, look no behind you. way. Look behind no you. No way. Whose turn is it next? No, 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 we made myself very clear. It was my turn to introduce myself. My name is Matt. Maybe we shouldn't do a seance. He's throwing up. He's throwing up. Dog. I gotta go tell them. Are you? Damn. What just happened? I've never had that feeling before. What just happened? I just felt really dehydrated. <coughs> and I felt this like pain in my stomach. I had to go. Did you throw up? I didn't throw up. I felt like I was going to for a second, but I just got in there and just. I just want the opportunity to experience and meet you in a safe, respectful <laughs> manner. <laughs> and I can't. We're I can't. just here. I just also want to chime in real quick. I'm not trying to interrupt him, but I'm really excited to see what you're going to do to Matt. No, I'm not. Um, please do not do anything to me. You already tried to have something fall on my head. Um, you already, like, gave Corey the, the first time he's ever seen a full body, full spirit apparition, and you just uh, put the, the fear of God and pain into Corbin. So, so you've really, so really, really been one of the good things, and I uh, really appreciate it if you continue that pattern. No, 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 no. Um, we're all good, actually. Yeah, Matt. Matt's well, also the strongest one here. So not true at all. Might need to use more force. I'm very for Matt than anyone else. If you haven't seen, he's got amazing abs, bad biceps. Nah. Um, he's got a really strong will as well. No. Strong jawline. Nice. Actually. So have you had that before? Not during like something like this. Elton you know, has. you know me. I've never like yeah. had that happen. Yeah. That's what I was just saying. No, I was weird. Like felt like somebody literally like stabbing me right here. I was like, oh. So we shouldn't do a seance. I'm skeptic of it, but I don't. I think it was because of the seance. Do you want to go back inside? I do. I do want to go back inside because that was weird. But we shouldn't do a seance. I don't know, man. That was weird. I'm not scared, like to go back in or anything like that. But that was just weird. I think that that was a spirit or something putting you through the pain that they went through. I think they were trying to show you. I'll be honest, you have a strong enough jawline, you can probably cut through ropes. But I wouldn't have. I wouldn't have. Yankee Jim's here, Yankee Jim's here, and you wanted to like, you know, see what he's made of. Um, nope. That would be great for I'm here to so. protect the Whaley House and respect it. Yeah. And uh, really, really excited. For I'm just here to be nice. Yeah. And I don't want anything done to me at all. Just here for some good old fashioned entertainment. Hopefully that can make you laugh a little bit. I'm sorry for the seance. Dude, man. that no, that was insane. That happened that happened to Elton before? Yeah. I forgot when that happened. I just felt a really weird pain in my stomach. And it felt dehydrated. I just immediately, uh, he said it felt like somebody was stabbing him. I think Corbin just came back. That hasn't gone off the whole time. Dude, it hasn't? No. No, but we did confirm that Matt is next. No, 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 no. I already got touched tonight, actually. We confirmed, so we confirmed Matt's next. Elton, I've already been touched tonight, yes. so I'm good. Can you touch that box again to confirm if you were making him feel a stabbing pain that you went through. Why did it do that? I will also say, he was holding my hand. Don't, don't do that. And he's closest to the. Dude. Dude. That kind of freaked. Honestly, that freaks me out a little bit. And it also touches the Queen Mary as well. Yeah. Why is it when I came back, that all this stuff is going on? When you, you, none you, of it was going you, you on. Came back on. That's weird, but I do want to. I, I, 
Yeah, do you want to sit out? Yeah, no, no, I want to sit down. I want to do this. The candle turns off as Corbin comes back to the table now. Now, what I was re explaining is I had the curtain fall on my head. Mm -hmm. You saw someone sitting in the chair, yeah. and Corbin got stabbed in the stomach. Oh, okay. So now it's Matt's turn. I've had my elbow. Well, and technically, I think maybe also Evans, because Kyle had his battery done. Very so true. It could be. It's really just Evan left, though, because I got touched already. So. No, you didn't. Yeah. When did you get touched? We were in the general store when he was given the, hey, the tour. You got touched? Both of them. Mm hmm. Hey, two, two down. Nose. Two down. Yeah, and we were standing there, we were getting the tour, and I felt like somebody just... Back on. This is really wild. Back Look, back on that again. It's back on. Interesting. Okay, let's do this. Are you okay. messing with our I candles? Can't, I need to open... I, I, like, I can't do this without introducing myself. It's Hello. I already did my three knocks on the wood just to make an entrance. I want to tell you that my name is Corbin Reinhardt. I don't mean any harm to you or anything for that matter, so please don't cause any violence or any harm back to us. Uh, I don't know what that feeling was that I had, and I don't know if it's any of you, but I would love to come across as peaceful, and we just want to ask questions. That's the only reason we're here. Amen. What the fuck was that? That was the weirdest thing I've ever seen. What? Holy what? shit. What? 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 We... Open your eyes. No, that was insane. What? what? That was insane. Explain it. That was one of the weirdest, coolest thing. I'm just. What do you see? How are you seeing? No, that's what I'm saying. What do you? You can see us. Like you have no, no pair of eyes. No. Double I, eyes. Dude. No, dude. I swear, I felt like my eyes were open, and I saw someone just looking at me. Like in like my eyes are closed, what? and I swear I saw two bright eyes. What do they look like? What do they look like? I don't know. Just two bright, like almost like orangey, the kind of like the candle eyes. This is not cool. Let's let go of each other's hands yeah. and introduce ourselves. Wait, no, eyes. isn't that the point of this? That you felt like you saw something? Yes. Then I maybe, feel like I saw maybe, like, like hey, maybe you're the conduit. Maybe you're the one that gets to see. Dude, I've never. Have we ever tried? Dude, that was really like I'm not scared. Like that was really cool. I'm gonna let go. Yeah. Let's uh, goodbye and thank you. That's yeah, how we're saying goodbye. Don't say goodbye. This is how isn't that how, you, isn't that how you end the seance? No, the whole point is to open this place up to okay. communicate with us. Well, we should break our hands now. All right, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That's terrifying. No, it's not. That was like, dude, did you not hear the number one thing the lady said about if you're possessed, you have another pair of eyes? No, 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 it wasn't that. It wasn't... You just said you saw another pair of eyes. No, it wasn't. Yeah, I would have another pair of eyes. Like I saw. How do you know? You uh, you don't know exactly what no, you would see. I saw like someone. You looking... saw somebody looking at you. Yeah, like I saw someone like almost like I don't know what position my head was at, but as if like you were sitting across the table from me. It wasn't like anything like grim or gruesome, it was just, I don't know, like I feel like if I tried harder, if I had like more practice, I could have seen who that person was. Well, it, it, it literally can be one of two things. Either one, yes, like you are getting more sensitive. Sensitive, and like, you know, how mediums can see stuff, like you were just saying, and you know, maybe that's what it was. Or, you also literally tried to get possessed at our last spot. And they did say that you have two pairs of eyes. This wasn't it. But what if it was you with your eyes closed looking into the other pair of eyes that you have? Yes. I think you should for right. sure figure Face out. FaceTime me on like right now. Because they can either say that you're more sensitive and like you're just more or sensitive. Or they could be like, no, that's not good. Yeah, either exactly. way, it's something to something else. Yeah. You're seeing something. And that's never. You should FaceTime them like right now. That's never yeah. happened. Yeah. See, that was cooler than any of the tools. Very, like I felt like I would have seen something. My right arm is hurting really bad, so I'm just trying to shoot all the energy out from my palm. Right to you. Point it about, yeah. Yeah, I'm getting away from now. Point it to me. No, like my know. my arm is like cramping right now. No, I have a question. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If there is something evil connected with Elton from the other night, could you please make one of our tools go off right now? Dude, I'm like, 
now it's from here to my wrist like everything hurts really bad i'm not even playing like this shit hurts did somebody here touch you dude what the Corey? fuck dog i'm gonna step outside bro i'm actually Elton, oh, so you got something attached to you man wait the fuck it's like from Does my hurt? from my ribs to here all of this hurts so fucking bad right now all of us but no one, no one said like, hey, don't do it. Hey, uh, no disrespect, Elton, but I'm not gonna be the only one in here with you. <laughs> oh, no, no way. Oh my god. Yes, this better Dude. not be no fucking demon from Elton trying to do shit to me or into me because I was holding his hand. Fucking. <sighs> I, I didn't lose the trivia game. This isn't, this isn't how this goes. You okay? Dude, this shit hurts really fucking bad. What is it? Huh? What is it? What is it? What kind From of pain? From here, all the way here, to now here. Originally, it was only to right here. That's what we're here to do. And no one wants to do it but me. No, dude, I was fine until I held his hand. I was really fine until I Dude, I'm What's telling you, he never should have did that shit, dude. He never should have. No. The witches said they something attached me. themselves. Yes, they, they told me personally that he was possessed. Dude. And they said that they cannot cleanse him. They dude. said that he has to. How do you do that? He has to believe. This is. And this he does. Dude. Hey, this is weird. Like, this is just weird. This whole place has been weird. This entire thing has been weird. I don't know Jesus. what's going on. I was really looking forward to this investigation, and now it's actually fucking yeah, terrifying. It's actually fucking scary. Just doing a seance if Elton's, is, if Elton's is fucking possessed is like not the best thing to do. Should we, should we show? Should we show? Can we show what it is? A little sneak peek. Should we show? Should we show what it is? Should we show what it is? I'm gonna be straight up too. Jokingly said like, oh, could you see the double eyes in Elton? She's like, Elton needs more cleansing, like. He seriously needs more cleansing and he won't do it because he has to do it himself. How do you get That's, cleansed? And that How? was that was the woman that wouldn't go on camera. Really? That was her. She has no reason to lie about that. Oh, I, I feel sick. Yeah, man. That, that's what I was feeling. That's what I was feeling earlier. Did you do it in the bathroom? Corey, you okay? Shit, dude, the, the the devil shit and the possession shit, I do not play with that at all. Ghosts is one ghosts are one thing. But demon stuff, that's not cool. So what are you doing? Just trying to find some ghosts. <laughs> Just you and me now. <laughs> they all left. They're not gonna be happy. I personally thought that was really cool. I've never seen anything like that. Well, we've also never done anything like that. Our Father who walked in heaven. Yep, Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Hey, you guys want to do the Our Father prayer? I got it, dude. I want to do it. Do you want to do the Our Father prayer like we did in the UK? Yeah. I don't know what the Our Father prayer is. You don't think something could fucking enter me from holding his hand? You got to do me and Father Son. I mean, in all possibility, put it this way: it can be fucking transferred. If if it did, right, would he hit him too? It'd it be all. There. It'd be all of us, technically. Because I, I've but now the him. pain is right here, and I feel like I'm gonna throw up. Like my cheeks are numb, and now right here hurts. You're gonna be okay, because even when I thought I was gonna throw up, I didn't throw up. Let's do the Our Father prayer. What is this? Just read it out loud. This is one of the three prayers they do for an exorcism. The, the power, power and the glory, glory forever, forever and ever. ever. Amen. Amen. That's cool. It's really cool. Should I Facetime them? Okay, let me get my phone. Yeah. I wonder if like Elton would like react to that shit if he like starts saying it. That's. I don't even know if I want to start be around him to stir that up though. To be ah. honest. What Evan? I'm sorry. What? What's going on? You are you guys coming back in? I'm yeah. cold. Yeah. I'm cold. I'm I mean, yeah, we're going back in. Okay. So we. All right. Yeah. Let's go. Spirits, entities, elementals, people, whoever's in here, we're sorry for rushing out like that. We just got a little spooked. We still would love to talk with you all tonight and communicate. So if you're willing to, please come talk to us. We're gonna set up some devices and tools around and you'll be able to touch them, put your energy into them and speak into them 
and that's how we can communicate with you. We rebuke all evil spirits. We want you as far away as possible. You're not welcome to interact with us. You're not welcome to follow us. Don't speak for me. Dude, I welcome you even saying that. It's like, yeah, not just cool, you. Yeah. I, welcome, yeah. I welcome all spirits, good or bad. Okay. If you're willing to communicate with me, I'm willing to communicate with you. Everyone deserves a chance. I rebuke, Maybe they're just perceived as evil. You, I rebuke all you shouldn't judge a book by its cover or a spirit by poltergeist Amen. activity. You know what I mean? Judgment's not good in this life or the past life or the next life. I want to remind you of one thing. The witches, whatever you want to refer to them as, did say when we were all there together. Mm -hmm. Was that they have spent over 20 years of their lives working in this field. Mm -hmm. And they said that the control they have over you is fed off of fear. So the more you fear them. I don't fear them, I just don't welcome them. Well, I'm then, not welcome. then be stern with them. It's no different than a Kennedy Mines or Preston Castles where he said, stay back. Is that three? That's three. That's three. Though, if you go into it, which is probably why I'm not afraid right now. Because I'm going into it with the mentality of, like, I'm not afraid of you. And showing your fear by leaving the building probably only gives them more motivation. So be confident that you're fine. And when mm -hmm. you feel those feelings, say, hey, just take what we've learned. Yeah, you're right. I mean, this, these are... These are Two women that have dedicated their lives to working with negative entities, and yet they still got on a plane the next day, and they still live normal, healthy, happy lives. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, yeah, you're right. No, you're you're completely right. We're, we we could be overthinking it. I think I was just overthinking it because I'm still scared about what happened at the Queen Mary. You know, but keep but, on, we had an amazing positive interaction with the Queen Mary. Mm -hmm. We did. Now that I come back in here, I'm feeling calmer. I feel good that I went outside and got that out of me. And I'm ready to hunt Just, some ghosts. Yeah, let's keep some open eyes. And up. this this could have been the realest seance we've ever done. You know what I mean? We're not following someone. We're not, you know, saying whatever they're telling us to say. We're really sitting at this table with all these candles. We introduce ourselves and talk to them. And now we're having a straight up conversation about the afterlife. You know? and, 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 I, and I wholeheartedly feel like if this is something we're going to continue to do, traveling to location after location, and this isn't even one with like a darker past, mm -hmm. then this is something we have to learn to work with yeah. and to understand. Because the whole point of coming here is to get activity and like the deepest form of it yeah. is when they touch you. If yeah. not, we're just gonna keep leaving. Yeah, no, you're right. And that's not the point of why we're here. Yeah, We literally did that and we got exactly what we asked for. I so feel like we definitely got the spirits awake the bear is currently on as well well where should we start investigating in here or better question hmm. where should Corey start investigating oh well is it time i, am so. I mean what <laughs> but I mean, i'm just saying i've been here by myself and i didn't even lose i'm gonna put a chair in front of the doorway so whenever that thing starts walking it can't get past it's me. fine you won't come in here it'll just come to you Wait, is the, if whatever this is the reason why we're feeling all of this? Yeah. What is that? I don't know. It's hard to tell. Is it evil what you brought? I don't know. It's hard to tell. He brought something evil. Can we unveil it? He brought something evil. Can we, can we it? Can we see what it is How about, before you guys leave me? We are all protected. Like, you know what I mean? Like, what do you mean? Yeah. What do you think it is? Bill Bear, I told you. Oh, so look at me. Okay. Please. Uh, nothing. What? What? You want to be dog? You see what I mean? Dog. You see what I mean? You guys act like I'm acting different, and it's like... No, your eyes look different! Dude, you they look, look different, different since the Queen Mary! Mm -hmm. I will say my eyes do change colors. I have hazel eyes, and sometimes they're brown, sometimes they're green. I swear? It's one of my best features, honestly. My eyelashes and my eyes are like kind of my it's only... It's not the color It's kind of my only eyes. good feature, to be honest. Like, if I didn't have these, I feel Ginger wouldn't date me. Elton, do you swear that you're not possessed? Or, or, is this, or is this the demon talking to us? 
Me, yes. as a conscious human, yes. the answer would be, I am not possessed. I feel no different than I normally do. You swear to God. Yes, but I don't believe in that. So... Awfully convenient. Do you swear to the universe? Miss Universe. <laughs> Which year? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, shout out to Aaron. Hey. Uh, what? Jesus Peace got the day before my jet ski hey, accident. Shout out. Fifteen dollars. Shout out. Uh, shout fake out. earrings from Hot Topic. Uh, six ninety nine. Uh, hand pee tattoo like rat to rat. Who give a fuck? Where'd you get that caged raccoon turtle in your forehead? I'm not there yet. Oh. Thank you, Evan. Actually. What's in that? Hmm. What's in that? <laughs> I don't know. So how about you boys start walking to your cemetery and let's get this over with. Well, first. Fuck. Oh. <laughs> God! I'll tell you this right now. Ooh. Anything starts going off. When I, when I reveal this. What? What? I'm so excited. Look at the cat ball. Look, the cat ball. Did that just go off? Yeah. I'm excited. I got a migraine. What's wrong? Oh, unveil it. Do it. Just do it like a band-aid. Pull it, pull it, pull it, pull it. Pull it. Like a band-aid. Why is there locks on it? Yeah. What? There's locks? Why would it be locked? <laughs> Come on. Go oh, pull it. This is the slowest Why are you doing pull? the slowest pull? No. It's impossible. Oh, this. That's oh another one! That's another one! Pull out! Go! Elton! Oh! 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 The man said we're all at the exact same time! Dude, I got this. They went off at the exact same time. I got this. Try what? Go, oh, pull, pull it. They pull went it. off at the. Elton, pull it. Oh my god. What is that? Elton. What is that? Elton. Are those legs? No! Dog! Get the fuck out of here. Where did you get that? Dude. Also, we know if you've seen Queen Mary Part 1, mm -hmm. there was a note that, or a notebook that Evelyn wrote in of what they saw. And Evan refuses to give us the paper. I want to know why. But I talked to him earlier. And he literally was like, all right, if you get enough people to harass you to, to give you the paper, we'll give it. So what? I don't, I don't know what that means. Maybe just like comment, Evan, give us the paper. Everyone comment down below, Evan, give us the paper. So I don't know. He was like, if you get enough people, he was like, he'll give it to us. But why, why is he asking? Why won't he just give it to I us? I don't know. I literally don't know. I barely remember what I wrote because I was just I like in yeah. the zone. Yeah. I don't remember what I wrote. 